Okay, so 2,000 miles in, and what are my thoughts on the Kawasaki Z900RS? Still absolutely loving it. Let's talk about comfort. So I've just been riding the bike for about three hours non-stop. Um, no aches, no pains, and my backside feels absolutely fine. Now, I must qualify that with the fact that my arse is made out of concrete anyway, so I can pretty much sit on anything. Um, but even so, finding the seat of the Kawasaki Z900RS, yeah, perfectly fine. Three hours in totally comfortable as i say no aches pains anywhere well no more than usual okay so what are the main mods i've made to the bike um well number one are the tires uh, so i've got rid of the oem tires and i've now got michelin road fives on which are absolutely sublime it feels like now tipping into corners and you know particularly s bends um, it feels like it's taken about 20 kilos off the way to the bike. Um, it's absolutely effortless going into corners now. And once you're actually lent over in the corner, so much confidence and so much feel. They are cracking tyres. I've not really had any chance to try them out in the wet yet, but um, fingers crossed I'm going over to Europe in a week or so's time, so I'm sure I'll hit some climate-induced um, storms and thunderstorms. So we'll, we'll give them a go then. But yeah, Michelin Road 5, brilliant tyres. Um, what else have I done? So as you can see, I've got a screen on the front. Um, this is a power bronze screen. It's pretty good price. Quality isn't the best, but it's, you know, it's perfectly adequate. But it does the job because it takes all the strain off your neck when you're travelling at high speed. So that's a good thing. Um, as you can see, it's a bit, but it's all right. Um, uh, I think you could possibly decapitate yourself on the edge of this, you know, in some kind of omen style traffic accident. But apart from that, it's absolutely fine. Uh, third thing I've done, put radiator guard on. Not much to say, really. Radiator guard is a radiator guard guard um, you know it does what it does and um, one thing about the radiator on the 2021 model is it's got like these horrible tabs on it and i think they're only there so you have to buy the new kawasaki radiator guard from their from their parts catalog which is a bit rubbish but there you go um so yeah i'm actually i'm not going to change anything else on the bike i'm not going to do the suspension i'm not going to do anything with the exhaust it suits me down to the ground um and i know a lot of people say about the suspension it's too soft but what i want to do is perfect and for me the suspension i know exactly what it's going to do it's predictable it might be soft but it's absolutely predictable and that's kind of what I want from suspension. I want to know what it's going to do. And I know what this is going to do in all situations. So for me, this is me absolutely down to the ground. So, um, yeah, I mean, the Z900RS is a brilliant bike, but you've heard me say that a million times before. I mean, to be honest with you, I could be riding a Mobilette 50, be in a place like this and still be having a fabulous time. So I suppose what I'm saying is motorbikes in general are the best machines in the absolute world. I mean, look at this. God, I've had a brilliant ride through Kielder Forest and through some little B roads. And what a beautiful day. What a beautiful place. And it was a motorbike that brought me here. And that for me is something really, really special. And the Z900RS. Yeah, I'm going to say it. This is a keeper and you can make me keep that promise. Okay, so I think the most important question to answer is, if the Kawasaki Z900RS were a biscuit, what type of biscuit it would be? Well, there's only one choice. There is only one answer, and that is the Bourbon Biscuit. Why? Because the Bourbon Biscuit is dark, it's rich, it's got a slightly exotic, but it's very, very creamy and powerful as well. And I think the other thing about a bourbon biscuit is that unlike, say, you know, the, the run-of-the-mill rich tea, 
the bourbon has got something just a little bit risky and naughty about it, which I think sums up the Z900RS perfectly. So if you were looking for an answer to that question, Z900RS is a bourbon biscuit. Mm-hmm.